house's gate. You look up at it. The house's gate, huh? It's bigger than I thought. It's so scary. It really is locked shut. I can see space for us to put the orbs. This whole adventure, this whole journey, after all this time, I can finally open it. I have my orb right here. Let's go for it then. Oh, up ahead, that's... The same sadness as before. A sadness, huh? The house must be crawling with them. Okay, everyone, let's... Um, uh... Don't get overwhelmed now. Come on, we've seen tons of those already. Don't worry, Belle. We can take care of them no problem. Okay, but... Last time, she felt better after talking strategy. We could do that again, or you could, you know, save time. Hmm. Hmm. Let's just defeat it. She'll be fine anyway, won't she? Ah, okay. You'll be okay, Mira. Yeah, let's go, everyone. Monster time! Uh, she's just regular paper. Oh, crap, no, that's a scissor. I'm, oh, no, I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay, well, luckily you do have a rock. So, we're gonna do that. Isbo, um, what's his crafts? Smash? Yeah, I might as well. And I could probably just attack. Yeah. Yep. Perfect. We did it! See, Myra? It wasn't that bad. Going through the house will be a piece of cake. You smile and take the lead. I see a few tonics on those tables. Make sure to pick them up and give them to Bonnie before we leave. Okay. Ugh, items pick up again. Do we really need these items? Oh. I'm surprised to hear this from you, since you just love to pick up random things. Of course we need those items. Tonics, juices, those items will keep our health up, and are integral to our survival. We can't always count on Mirabelle to heal us. Don't hesitate to use those tonics or items in battle if you get overwhelmed. This seems important. You decide to remember those words. It'd be bad to be beaten in a battle because you forgot about the items you carry. You got a memory of tonics. You'll always remember this. When memory of tonics is equipped, any tonic the researcher uses will recover more HP. What? You decide to remember those words. So maybe it's Odile? Yeah! Odile knows her tonics. Health items used by Odile using battle will restore more HP. Hmm. Let's... We can always equip that any at any time. Key time. You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. Oh, wait. That's the room you died in because you didn't check for traps. There must be a switch or something that can stop the trap from activating. You didn't feel it last time, but you can feel something different in this room. I see it. I know. This is a normal pillar, but carefully you look at the pillar. Oh, stars. Hidden unless you're looking at the right angle. You can see a switch, betwe switch between the rocks. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Oh, wait! Sifrin, I just remembered this room! It's... You press the switch. Dang. Ah! Whoa! Okay, the rock fell. And not on your head. Woohoo! So you can change things. You can fix things. You can keep going. You're feeling a lot more competent about this killing a monarch business. You give a thumbs up. Trap taken care of. I, I suppose it is. That was scary! Oh, before you forget, you should ask. Any more death corridors, Myra? Death corridor? Um, no. That's the only one. I promise. This hallway had a trap, which Sifrin just activated, but I don't think there's any other ones in the house. Good to know. Let's get going, then. Oh, wow. No, no, no. Oh. Oh! Look, at, look on the wall, there's a sword! 
The sword looks rapier-like. You want to take it, Mira? Hmm. Taking things that don't belong to you is bad. But yes, I would like the sword. You got over that quickly. <laughs> needle sword. You can give the needle sword to Mirabelle to equip later. You found a weapon! Weapons and armors can be equipped by going through the menu. And then to equip. This specific weapon is for your little housemaiden. Don't forget to equip it! Interesting. Alright. Oh, it's the defense that goes up. And only little attack? Yeah. Well, yeah. That's totally fine. Hmm. A big steel thing with a stone on it and an oven for weapons. Those things have a name, but you can't remember what it is. It's a forge, and that's an anvil, Sifrin. And the stone is a sharpening stone. Oh, yeah. So I re- Okay, 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 alright, I understand now. The little ding is what you remember. And that's some that is something that you can come back to and you'll have you'll have something different. I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. The door is locked. The symbol over the keyhole is shaped like an egg. Okay, weird. The cupboard is full of various board games. A craft game for kids, a fishing game, checkers. Checkers. We should play team checkers again. Sim and I will kick your butts. Um, I think I'll pass. Last time we played, Sifrin cheated the whole time and you didn't even notice. My obliviousness makes me a wonderful teammate. <laughs> nice. Let's see. Salty broads. Hello, hello, Stardust. Got your hand on some salty broads, didn't you? Drinking one in battle will lower... Oh, lower all of someone's craft cooldowns by six. So they're very useful. Use them wisely. Bye, Stardust. Have fun. Don't get crushed by rocks! <laughs> oh, there's something over there. What are you? Oh yeah, some weird water? I've heard about it from the people in Dermont. They call those tears. If you touch one, you'll be frozen in time. That's what they told me. There are a few other- there's a few outside the village, too. Tears, huh? Maybe tears? Maybe they're called tears. Like, tears in time. There might be a lot of those around the house. You know that dying of natural causes will bring you back, but what about being frozen in time? Is it different? Would it stop you from looping back? Touch it? You only live once. Don't touch it. Yeah, that's scary. You should just go ahead and move on. Okay, we get it. Let's stop looking at it. Can we go already? Ah! Oh. Siv! <laughs> oh my gosh. It's here. Or a tear froze you in time. Start again, I guess. Oh! You see something appear before you. Hello? I, I have important news. What's the important news? That pet's quitting. Matt Pet's quitting? <laughs> Are you? <laughs> you've got to be fucking. You got to be joking. Ninth, I will be hosting my last theory episode. Bruh. All right. Back to the game. <laughs> Is this Dormant? And the house? Can you decide where to loop back? What? Oh, that changes the game. I kind of want to go to the house one more. You can see the village of Dermont. Something is keeping you from getting there right now. It's me. <laughs> Don't worry, I promise you'll get to loop back to Dormont at some point. But it's tutorial time now. You have no choice. Ugh. Loop back to floor one? Yeah. Oh, you're back. For a second, you were genuinely worried you weren't going to loop back and stay frozen in time forever. Being frozen in time felt like sleeping. So, tears freeze you up in time. And being frozen in time makes you loop back. Seems like a pretty painless way to loop back whenever you please. Interesting. I like that. I like that. So, I don't have the sword anymore. 
Oh, look on the wall. There's what? Nothing. It's just a normal, boring wall. What the? F Whoa! You stumble. There was something there. You remember? Did this happen because whatever you found here before is already in your possession? You feel dizzy. Oh, it's because it's in her. Oh, it's because it's in her inventory already. You're going to do paper. Oh, goodness gracious. You just need to attack. There you go. Oh my gosh. Odile is a heavy hitter. Ignore everyone's confused looks at the tear and keep walking. No, no. Oh my gosh. There you go. Sick. Have you never seen a lock like this before, Siv? It's a special kind of vo Volgardian lock. Instead of a key, it needs specific words to be open. Words. Yeah, you just need to say the words out loud. I think they call it a... Uh, an open phrase? An open phrase. Fascinating. So, what is the phrase for this lock? I... do not know. Uh, so it's locked. Yeah. Yahoo. What's this room, though? I think it may be a storage room. I often saw Dormont's shopkeeper go there. He might know the open phrase for it. If we had remembered to ask. Oh. Well, too late now, right? Hmm. There you go. All right. A way to open it will be the shopkeeper. Yes. Okay. I was totally right about that. Kidding. Interesting. I am definitely not looking around me, and I'm admiring the view instead, so tell me if I'm about to run into something dangerous. Whoa, 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 whoa. You keep Isabeau from running into the life-ending tears. Huh? Huh? Uh, what? What is it? Is it the water? Should I not touch the weird floating water? The same weird water as before. Oh, wait! I've heard about those! The villagers in Dormont call them tears. And if you touch them, you get frozen in time. All right. They haven't talked about it before. Wait, so I almost died? Maybe you should pay more attention, distracted one. I'm keeping my eyes open for all threats except the ones in front of me. We should be more careful. We wouldn't want to touch those. Also, also, I also heard that being frozen makes you go to sleep and gives you a super good dream. Oh? 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 Oh. Did you hear this from the people in Dormont, too? Uh, um, um, a nice lady told me that when she heard my sister got frozen. Oh. 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 I know it's not true. I'm not stupid. Just, it would be nice if that was true. So. Oh. So you said touch the weird frozen water and be frozen and let me know how it goes. Pass. Well, we might still need to go this way, so we should look around and find a way, uh, find if there's a way to make those disappear. Nice. Good to know. All right. A sadness? Oh, poor buddy lost its friends. Whoa, this one feels weird. Boniface, it may look different, but it's still a sadness like all the ones we've seen before. Still feels weird. I believe the preteen. What? I believe the preteen when it comes to the sadness weirdness, madame. Let's get the weird sadness then. Examine it. Because I don't know what this is. This one. Is it just me or is there something weird about it? it? Seems a little stronger than the sadnesses we've seen so far. And it's not showing its hands. It's crabbing annoying. We could observe its attacks or look at it carefully when we hit it. Oh, interesting. So, attack, attack it with hand. So that's paper. Critical. Okay, so it's a... Alright. So, it should be a rock then, right? There we go. Perfect. Yay, Bonnie! Oh my gosh. Okay. You should heal... 
Odile. Oh, good idea. <laughs> oh, bro, Odile looks sick. Oh my gosh, I love that sprite. Odile time. Can't do paper, so just got a normal attack. There we go. Try this out. There's five. Yeah! Heck yeah. The sadness left something behind when it dissolved. You got the star crest. It has a teardrop, teardrop engraved on it. You put the star crest in your pocket. A crest? Feels weird, too. Like the tears we just saw. Okay. Hmm. Maybe this crest can help us clear the way? Okay, this might be stupid, but what if you use the star crest you got on those tears and see if it does something? There's a teardrop engraved on that star crest after all. And if it doesn't work, well, you look stupid, but you can always look back and not stupid. Yeah. Yeah, it works. It worked! Bye bye, tears! Phew. Oh. Ow! You hit your hip into the counter and made an embarrassing sound. Uh oh! Sifrin. Did you really hit the counter and say, Nya? <laughs> you did. No. Okay, Nya. Madame! <laughs> the kitchen closet. You open it. You found the egg key. You put the key in your pocket. You now know where the egg key is located. The keychain dangling from it is shaped like an egg. Does it mean something? That's an egg. An egg? Bonnie is making grabby hands. You give Bonnie the key. Ah, so the next key should be a broken egg, right? Are eggs important to the change beliefs somehow? Yes! An intact egg and a broken egg! We... We're the egg. Getting out of the egg. Change also means destruction, blah blah blah. Well, um, yes, pretty much. Can't make pancakes without breaking a few eggs. It's omelets, Bonbon. Bon. You're an omelet, za. Terrifying rebuttal from the preteen. And, and, for every change, something needs to break. Maybe changing yourself will hurt someone. Maybe changing leaves me means leaving a part of yourself behind. It's to remind us that before changing, we must stop and think about what will be irreparably destroyed. But destruction is just part of change, and we must accept it. Yeah, it'd be awful to keep yourself from becoming a person you feel comfortable with just because it would upset someone else. Huh. That's a harsher belief than I thought. Bonnie is still looking at the egg keychain. Chomp. Bonnie tried to take a bite of the keychain. Chomp chomp. It's carved out of stone, Boniface. Maybe the keychain had a secret, madame. Uh-huh. Stupid crab and rock. Bonnie gives you back the key. It's sticky. <laughs> the gate is locked. Well, this one I expected would be locked. Where does it bring us? Farther into the house? Yeah. This is the only way to the second floor. No wonder the king would make sure no one could get in. I'm telling you, the king is scared of us. Maybe he is, but in the meantime, we should find a way to open this door. You look at the gate a little bit closer. Hmm. The keyhole is shaped like an egg, broken in half. Well, don't I have that? Egg key, yeah. Where could the key be? I, I have it. Do I not? It? Wait. Oh, now I'm confused. Alright. Let's heal one more time, and then I'm going to loop back. Because I feel like I... I need to go to the shopkeeper, right? Hmm. Oh, hi. You're one of the... S Odile? Yes, Odile. She's from Kabu, yes? My sister visited Kabu once. Did you know they call the most... Oh, did you know they call most people by their last names? Such a different culture. And this Odile, hmm, I can tell. She's like the mom of the group, isn't she? Huh? Something feels weird. 
When you asked her about Isabeau, didn't she tell you she was an only child? Oh. Oh. Oh, no. So, oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. But this loop, she says she has a sister? Aren't you an only child? What? No, I have a sister. She's a few years younger than me. A few years ago, she decided to travel the world all on her own. She lives in another country now. Isn't that so brave? Living in a foreign country just like that? You want to ask her more, but she's already back to her daydream. Interesting! Know anything about the locked doors in the house? Locked doors? Ah, yes. There's one locked by one of those word locks. Let's see. Ah, I remember. The open phrase to it is... Stos... The storage room room room. Because there's a storage room inside. But I didn't want it to unlock if you just said storage room. <laughs> what the f- What the fuck? Don't look at me like that! Well, either way, there's not much in there. Nonetheless, I hope it helps you on your journey tomorrow. So weird. The door unlocked. What? Well, let's go inside then. Oh, another hole in the wall. More tonic. We got ginger juice, sweet tonic. Sweet tonic, interesting. What is this? It's a Potterian Vogardian translation dictionary. It's open to a page of Vogardian words starting with a T. Tacticurn? What does tacticurn mean? It's someone who doesn't speak up very often, Boniface. Oh, like Fryn. Okay. Yes, just like Sifrin. Hey! I speak up sometimes. Um, not really, Siv. My teacher always says we gotta speak up more. You're an adult, so why don't you speak up more, stupid? Why don't you? You just don't have much to say. It's simpler to just let people talk. I just don't have much to say. Mmm. And it's nice to hear you all talk. Oh. Aww. That's cute. That's a lovely say thing to say, Sifrin. Huh? Feels like we tamed a wild animal, doesn't it? Perfect analogy. Maybe soon we'll even be able to pet them. Oh, crap, stop! Just imagining it makes me emotional! Are they making fun of you? You hide your face under your hat. See, now he went be- Now he went back to being a shy, skittish animal. All this hard work. Wasted. Face warm, you walk away. <laughs> yes, yes, we're coming. <laughs> this is really cute. Key time. There we go. Progress! Progression! Oh, crap. That's this guy. Please don't hit them. Okay, good. Actually, that was great. Oof. Yikes. Um, okay. You should heal him, honestly. And you can do a paper on this guy. Attack you. Should be dead. Oh my gosh, you're not dead? Are you serious? That one is probably gonna kill him. There you go. Okay. No, no, no. I'm good. I'm good, actually. Oh. Oh, hello. Shiny. A dresser with a dresser with art books on top of it. You open the drawer. You found the broken egg key. Yeah. You put the key in your pocket. You now know where the broken egg key is located. Sounds like keys will be in your future, huh? You should probably remember, try to remember their location just in case. You get the memory of keys. You will always remember this. When looking at a locked door, you'll get a sense of where its key is. If you've already found the key in a previous loop, it'll you'll get directions as to where to go. Pretty useful if you're the forgetting type, huh? In someone's drawer. What a weird place for a key. 
definitely not very king-like place, huh? It's pretty stupid of him. I'm not sure. Hiding keys in places like drawers isn't very king-like, yeah, but it means that they're harder to find since it's not a very expected place. But thankfully, we have our good old Civ here to find us. Find us? Find them. Thank you, Sifrin. Good job, Sifrin. Yay, good job. She claps sarcastically, which makes everyone join her enthusiastically. You take a bow. <laughs> Some rolled up papers. You unroll one. It's a bunch of sketches of landscapes. Oh my. The paper is filled with sketches of naked people doing fun things. You look at them curiously. Oh, oh my. Huh, neat. Show me. I can't see what it is. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Mirabelle hurriedly covers Bonnie's eyes and makes them take two steps back. But I want to see! No, 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 no. It's not allowed. You're not allowed. Yeah, it's not for little ones, Boniface. Yep, can't let you do that, Bonbon. Bon. Meh. Bonnie is looking straight at you. Friend. Can I look? Well, nah, definitely not. Oh. Oh! So it's really not allowed. Why did it take Sifrin saying it for you to realize? Friend lets me do things when you guys say no sometimes. But even if Friend says it's not allowed, then it must be something really not allowed. So, I won't look. Well, good? Sifrin! What in the crap did you let Bonnie do when you said no? Whoa. You let me drink some vodka once. Whoa! <laughs> what? Sifrin! Whoa! <laughs> I don't really get why Old Aya likes it, though. It tasted just like boring water. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that sounds like an amazing practical joke to play on a kid, actually. It was! <laughs> That's funny. Leveled up. A few of them. We're gonna do egg key. Key time! You insert the key into the keyhole and open the door. Same door as the outside. A sadness! It seems to be guarding the rest of the house from us. It feels strong. Stronger than those we've seen so far. Get ready, everyone. Yeah, boss fight. Boss battle. Big ball head. Big ball head. Wait, something's happening. Mmm. Something appeared for a second on the big ball head. That was a paper sign? Does it mean something? We can probably assume that's its current craft type. If you need help, Sifrin, let me know and I'll analyze this enemy. Critical. Nice. Oh, now your scissors. Oh, thank you, Bonnie. Well, we might as well just do a scissors attack on it. Immune? Immune. Okay. Oh, nice. Isabel can just regularly attack. Odile can do a rock. Nice. Her attack is literally gonna do nothing, so we should heal Sifrin first. Bam! So this one is actually gonna work. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, paper now. Okay. There we go. Perfect. Heavy hitters. Oh my gosh, it's so close. Okay. Guard again. Thank you! Oh my gosh. Yes! Yes! Okay, good. 48. 
buy one get one three lovely moving cure nice we did it victory all right let's keep moving Mirabel just learned a new skill oh think change I'll be able to I'll be able to help out more memory of lovely moving cure you'll always remember this when equipped, your housemaiden will be able to use Lovely Moving Cure as a skill, even if she isn't at level 47. Lovely Moving Cure is a skill that cures Frozen for one friend. It's very useful that she knows this. That is very useful, actually. Uh, I think I'm hungry. My time! My time! <laughs> My time to be the leader! Why? Because it's snacks time, baby! Snacks are important to keep hunger away and keep morale up. I learned that because I'm a growing kid. That sure is true. But, but do we have time to... Mira. Let's take a break, alright? Even people blessed by the change god like you need a break sometimes. Alright. You guys stay here. I'll get some snacks ready. Okay, snack leader. Oh, I remembered something. Isabeau, heads or tails? Huh? Um... Tails! Odile takes a coin from her pocket and flips it in the air. Flip, 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 flip. It fell on tails. Huh. I lost. Yay! What do I win? The sweet taste of victory and nothing else. I don't even get a congrats. Wow, madame. I thought we were friends. We're not friends. We're associates. Not companions? Colleagues. Allies at best. Not even soulmates? I can't believe you've gone down to being an acquaintance now. No! What was the coin flip about, madame? Ah, uh, well, I asked the favor tree to make, make me win my next coin flip. Huh? Such a silly favor. Purely for scientific reasons, I was wondering whether this favor tree business had any truth to it. As we can see, it doesn't. Oh. Hmm. Well. But Madame Odile didn't put any thought or hope into her favor, so why would it come true, right? If you want to say, s if you want something to come true, it definitely will. You think so? Absolutely. Aww. That's right. Bonnie probably wished for their sister to be okay, didn't they? Okay, who wants snacks? I have snacks! Today, I have many snacks at your disposal. I have... Some plantain chips! Oh! Did you use the last of those not-bananas to make them? Yes. Yes, I did. Crunchy, delicious, and full of potassium. That's plantain chips. You all clap. <laughs> Second snack is... Some boring but delicious cookies. Cookies! Great sales pitch, Bonbon. Bon. Boring but delicious. Cookies, the taste of home. What kind of home is boring but delicious? Zah, you're weird. <laughs> and for a third and final snack, we are proud to present. Uh. Some, uh. <laughs> Onigiri. 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 Onion giri. You messed that one up on purpose. Yes. I have some onigiris for everyone. <laughs> one of those cob one rice balls, right? Yeah. Rice. I love rice. You and every other kid on this planet, Boniface. <clears throat> now choose. Choose which one you want. Don't worry, I have enough for everyone. I'll take a cookie. There. You. Go. Me as well, please. Bonnie hands you and Mirabelle a, a few cookies. Delicious, delicious cookies. Boring, but you can never get sick of them. So, do you all like it? Did I do a good job as snack leader? You absolutely nod. Yeah, this is good. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Uh you say very loudly. 
Thank you, Snack Leader, for this delicious meal. Oh, this is so good. Thank you, Bonnie. <laughs> so good, Bonbon. Bon. I feel refreshed, invigorated, and alive. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, dial. Mm, good food. Yummy, yum, yum. Yes! <laughs> you got a memory of snacks. You'll always remember this. When equipped, memory of snacks make the makes the kid more likely to heal during battle. Ooh. That's actually really nice. Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh-huh. That's what I want. So that was stupid. We can't be friends. That'd be like being friends with your mom or your sister. So then, which one is Odile? Um, actually, Dial's more like a grandma, isn't she? And you definitely can't be friends with your grandma. Is that how it works? <laughs> I hope everyone is alright. The people in Dormont? Yeah, but the King's Curse probably got to them already. It was so close when we arrived a few days ago. Even if we decided to go back, there'd be nothing to come back to. So all we can do now is... T tell me a joke, Sifrin, please. To get my mind off of things. Oh, um, I had a meeting with a plum today. A plum? Like the fruit? Yes, that meeting was... Oh, let me guess. It was a very fruitful meeting. Oh no. Was that it? Sorry for stealing your joke? This is the worst thing that could ever happen to you. Who are you if you're not the funny jokes pun person? <laughs> hmm. I hope I didn't make Bonnie upset earlier. You both look Bonnie's way. Bonnie is stuffing their cheeks happily. <laughs> Never mind. Hey, Siv! Let me guess, you're still hungry? I can see it on your face. One half of this cookie. Isabel waves his last cookie at you. Yes. Nah, it's fine. Okay, let's try that again, and this time you say, Yes, please, Mr. Amazing, Wonderful, Funny, Buff Isabel. I ask again, would you like half of this cookie? Yes, please, Mr. Amazing, Wonderful, Funny, Buff. Of course! Here you go! Isabel gave you half of his cookie. Chomp. Thank you. No problem. That was really cute. <laughs>